Hey, what's going on my friends? It's Austin from Elevate Applicate and today I want to talk to you about the importance of having labels and SDS sheets in your trucks and at your place of business. Having them available for clients. Um, I recently, I don't want to say recently, but in the last couple of years I attended some seminars and uh, a gentleman pointed out that he had a binder, and I'll show you mine. Um, this is a binder of all of our pesticide labels and SDS sheets. This took a lot to make. You can see it's pretty thick. It's a pretty thick book, but every single one of our trucks has that in it. And the reason for that is for a couple reasons. One, you want to have those labels available for um, medical purposes, right? So most importantly, medical, okay? You need to have that. What if an accident happens, right? Um, and you need a doctor and a doctor needs to know, have you been exposed to pesticides? Are there pesticides? Are there certain things that precautions I need to take? So doctors need to know this, right, for health and safety. Second of all, accidents. You need to have that for accidents when, if and when that happens. For firefighters and first responders, they need to know how to deal with pesticides if they arrive on scene and, you know, God forbid your truck decided to flip over because of an accident or something stupid happens. They need to know how to use these and what to do and what sort of fire suppression to use, um, what sort of PPE they need to use, things of that nature. And lastly, I'll put this one to diffuse, how should I word this? To diffuse passers-by. passers-by and this one I'm gonna put red because to me that one is a very unique one what do I mean by diffuse passerbys so if you're out there doing applications right you're doing lawn applications maybe you're doing perimeter pest control uh, maybe you're doing mosquito applications maybe you're spraying some trees well if you're in urban areas like most of us are performing these services what can happen is you're performing these services and somebody's walking by now you don't have eyes in the back of your head so you can't see what's going on all the time you should be looking around and seeing your environment out there, seeing if a, a, a lady is walking up with a stroller and a baby, or you know, is there a school bus dropping off kids over here? You, know, you should be paying attention to your environment, but you, can't, you don't have eyes in the back of your head, so you can't see this all the time. And I don't know if you ran into this, but I've had people that have been walking by stop me and say, hey, what are you spraying? What are you doing? And so I have to tell them. And sometimes they're not necessarily the happiest of people to deal with. And they're like, well, I want to know the label. I want to know if I've been poisoned, blah, blah, blah. So the options that you have in that moment are you can say, well, ma'am, they're at the office. We can send them your email. I'll take it on your email address, and then you know, we'll send them to you. So that way you know what we were doing here. And that is an option. Uh, it's probably not the best option. Why? Because this person now has time to walk home and start to think, was I poisoned? Did they spray me with pesticides? What are these pesticides? And then they go to social media and they start to bash your company or bash you. Okay? And that one is kind of terrifying because very quickly your company could have a really bad name and a really bad rap because of how you handled somebody walking by. So we carry the labels in our trucks with the SDS sheets attached. So that way if somebody asks, we can just open our binder. It's all labeled on where they are. We flip it open to where it is. We pull it out and hey, here's, here's the product. Hey, here's the SDS sheet. This is how much it takes before it can do X, Y, Z. And you can diffuse the situation pretty quickly. Now, obviously, you're not going to diffuse every situation, right? There's going to be people that, you know, they don't trust true science or what the EPA has approved. But this is just some reasons why we need to have the labels and SDS sheets in the truck. And you need to have applicators that are trained to know where this is. If you can have this in the exact same area in every single truck, even better, because now everyone knows where it is. This isn't the most riveting content out there, I get that, but this is important, 
especially if you're a pesticide applicator, especially if you're being professional, want to be professional, especially if you have technicians out there in the field, you need to be comfortable with labels and SDS sheets. And you need to be comfortable in presenting the information. If your technicians just know, hey, use this product like this, with this, at this ratio. Well, they don't really know the in-depth thought process or the in-depth information of that product. But if you get them to study the labels and the SDS sheets, now they're gonna understand, okay, here's the toxicity. Okay, here's why there's a B restriction on it. Here's why you can't use this around aquatic environments. And they'll be more educated for when they talk to clients. So this is just a, a cry out there saying, hey, if you're in the pesticide industry as pesticide applicators, you need to start studying your labels and SDS sheets. You need to carry them on the truck for medical reasons, for um, accidents, to diffuse passersby, to understand the rates if a label falls off a product so you know exactly what rate to use, right? These are critical and that's why the manufacturers give them to us. These are not the only thing that we need to be worried about because companies can provide bulletins that you're responsible for uh, understanding. So you should visit these uh, manufacturer sites and look to see if there's any updates. So without further ado, that was just a quick little rant about labels and SDS sheets and why they're important. I hope you guys are doing well. Take care. God bless. Go get them. And like and subscribe this video. I appreciate you.